Hi, you guys! Welcome to the General Anatomy. I'm just finishing up the class so, um, in the background. I'm Christoph Mühlinghaus. The people in the class call me Dr. M. Makes it a little easier. <clears throat> Um, I'm the guy who teaches the lecture portion, so you'll be watching a lot of videos of me um, in the background. The lecture portion is online. The lab portion is in person. That's going to be Carl Estrada, who's doing Estrella, sorry, who's doing that. Um, and you're meeting on Tuesday and on Thursday in in, in Science 116 between 5:30 and 8:30 p.m. And so that's in person. The lecture is online. The lab is in person. He will talk about um, the lab lecture the lab portion and i will briefly introduce the lecture portion right here um we share the grades 50 50 so it's about all you know weight more or less 50 50 in terms of uh that part um but without further ado so to speak let me just go and, and share my screen with you guys and when you get into the class this is the first thing you see you see uh, a little picture and and then contact information link everything is aligned here is a link little thing here this is my phone number so you can call me 510-387-2946 actually don't call me text me i don't pick up calls really because there's too many people trying to sell me stuff um but text me and i'm always here for you i'm also on pronto that's probably the primary way we communicate but this is also a backup always here and then down in here is a little video which is going to be a new one and then here are a few links. One, you go to the material, you go to syllabus, we go to Zoom sessions. Every week I do a Zoom session in the beginning uh, of the week on Monday. So tomorrow, actually, we do have a Zoom session at 11 o'clock. I mean, today on, on Monday, the first day, we have a Zoom session at 11 o'clock till about 11.30, they're about a half hour. I preview the class. The Zoom is always, the idea is always 780. 788-6686. And you will see that printed all over the place. I sent you an email with it already. They're not mandatory. I know it's pretty short notice and people are probably even working or so. But if you can make it, do please make it to those sessions because I discussed the week that's ahead and the material and the assignments and things so you can get a, an understanding of what's happening. Uh, during the week and kind of gauge and don't have to all figure it out. And it's also a good place to ask questions uh, 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 and we can sort of have a dialogue. Uh, but if you don't uh, can't make it, I record it. So it's going up behind here and there's, there's always a, a page that shows that video link um, that I will show in a set in a minute. Um, and you can also always text me if you need to talk to me or have a Zoom um, uh, with me to clarify the material and so forth. I do not want you to have anxiety around this stuff. I want you, I mean, if you don't study, obviously you do, but I don't want you to have anxiety around figuring out what's what. I want you to reach out to me and really focus on the material as much as you can. I'm kind of like your coach in that way. So you can always reach out. If I don't want to, you know, text back, I put the phone somewhere else. Um, this is a study tool link that we'll have an assignment about, so we'll really figure out how to study this the material well. And then also I have a Zoom link where you guys can meet. On, 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 this is always open, and if you click here, it goes up to a different you know Zoom link, and you guys meet up here. I know you always also meet in person every week, but sometimes it's nice to have that online as well. I also do some classes that are purely online. So let's go into the material right here. So every week is more or less structured the same way. The beginning of the, of the week is an introduction. We have that weekly Zoom preview laid behind there. Then we have a list of assignments that we're going through the week. And we also have a list of what you're learning this week. You know, I don't need to go into that. You can uh, check that out. Um, and then we go into a section where we learn the material before we then apply the material. Learning in this situation here is online it's mostly videos i made it's all videos actually on the lecture end of things i made two versions of the videos i made actually three versions really i made uh, a one where i talk into the computer that's the le the voice over lectures and then i have and you see always where how long they are like five to ten minutes so there's a few of those but then i also put a lecture where i in the class i talk to the students 
and I recorded myself before the pandemic. And so you, um, some people like that. It's more interactive a little bit. But that's a longer lecture. It's just one because I didn't break that down when I made it. Um, and then you can also have a link going to YouTube. Everything is also playlists in YouTube. So in case you want to just put it on your phone or something. Except actually Canvas has a really cool phone app. So make sure you download that for both, um, uh, both parts. Uh, both iPhone and the other one as well, Android. And then and then on each section, I have um, main concepts that I organize and, and bullet point. So the main points are bullet points. This is a great way of making flashcards or stuff like that. Make sure you understand all those points. And I also try to get a lot of pictures in there. Um, uh, it's always great to go Google and get more pictures though. I have one assignment where I teach you how to do that or just get you through the process. I'm sure it's easy to do, but uh, I've I've learned a lot like that these days, especially since visualization is so great to learn this material, it's visual material. And then after you get the lecture in, then you're gonna apply it. And, and every lecture has questions laid behind it. These questions are in, oh, look, this is locked. Oh, because it's not, you know, sorry. And I'm a student. So these are questions in a, in a question um, and a quiz format. Let me just show you in the background here. I can pull it out this way. Um, and so you you use it's mostly yes or no, multiple choice. Sometimes in a later chapters we do some fill in the blanks as well. But you can take those questionnaires over and over and over. See here, it's like a preview here. See, so it's like that. You have a a question like that, and then. And order, you know, and then you 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 answer, and you can take them as many times as you want. You have as long as you want. So this is really how you massage the material into your brain. I want you to uh, get the material from different angles, and so this is one way of me explaining it to you with the questions behind it. Um, and I also made a video of that. So if you're actually going like, I don't really understand what he's talking about, you just watch the video, and then you you get some of the answers and explanations as well. Uh, because I'm really interested in that in that in that massaging that most material in your brain in multiple different ways, and then we'll remember it. Um, and so that's and this is 10% of the grade, all of these questions of all of everything. And so that's a busy work. You can get points that way. Uh, of course, there's also tests. There's three tests, and the tests are I think uh, there might the lecture tests are 25% of the of the grade. Um, and those are ones that are similar format to this in a quiz sort of structure, but you can only take them once and there's a timer on it. Um, but that way, by the time you get to the test, you kind of know how it works. Uh, the system works. If you haven't been around this Canvas thing for a while, this is called Canvas, this whole thing. This learning management system. And then we have multiple discussions. We have in the beginning chapters some discussions where I ask you, different concept questions, things that I want you to be a little bit more familiar with. I also put some videos behind there, low, so you can learn that. Oh, here, look, I want you to do, actually write down protein synthesis and mitosis in the chapter of that and write it out in your words, or you can make a video with it. So that's really cool about Canvas, especially I like the video or the, the function of making a video and then uploading it on the app for the phones. Because it's so intuitive. We already do it anyway when we do social media or so. And so that's also a great way. So we have these discussions where you talk to each other um, in, in a typing format or also in a video slash audio format. I'm very interested in you guys being creative and using different ways of present, getting the material to me. Um, or just being tuned in what works for you. That's really important. And then I also have some examples, uh, some things, a, a few other um, assignments and exercises. And one type is called a health kit. And the health kit brings the material uh, closer into the real life base. So for example, when we talk about chemistry, I want you to read some food labels and make a little chart and have an exercise on that. Like go to the store or go to the cabinet and see what you bought. Um, and, and so forth. And so, so those are on their health kit. And those are activities that are uh, half discussions around it, but they're trying to make the, bring the material close and again, massage it in some way that we understand it, but in a way that is applicable to the life, to the real life. 
Anyway, so that's that. And then in the first week, it looks like very busy, but it's a lot of small stuff where we, you know, read the syllabus and and, and update the profile and, and think about studying and how much time do I need to put aside? Things like that. So preparation work. So don't be too alarmed when you just first see it go like, oh, my Lord. Anyway, I'll hopefully see you all tomorrow or I mean today on Monday, the first day. Uh, or many of you, and otherwise just reach out if you have questions, and I'll be dialoguing with you also on Canvas. All right? Have a good one. Take care. See you soon. Bye-bye.